Hello everybody, this is Nel Caroco again and today we will discuss what is the difference between illuminance and luminance. This is from my previous video on how to, the basics of lighting design. Okay, so what is illuminance? Illuminance describes the amount of light falling into or illuminating a given surface area. You illuminate something by shining or projecting light toward it. While the luminance is the amount of light reflected off a surface being illuminated. This is how you convert luminance to illuminance. Okay, so how are we going to explain it in a simple way and a more easy way? Okay, so let's go and use the same project that I used in my previous video. This is the VIP suite. And I will create a calculation on the table and I will show you the effect of uh, the difference between luminance and illuminance. Okay, so I'll go now this uh, space tab and I will turn off this create working plane and I will add one object here. Let's just imagine that this is my table. Okay, and I will place it on the top of my uh, luminaire and I will uh, assign the top of the table so I'll go to this calculation object and then I will uh, add a calculation surface on this one and draw a calculation object here and say this is my calculation surface I can go and use the the surface of the table as my calculation surface but I will just uh, do differently because I will use this calculation surface for both the illuminance and luminance. So I will increase this one as one meter so it will be on that, the top of the table and then I will turn on the false color and the value chart so we can see it and then I will turn on this um, horizontal illuminance. There you go. So let's turn off this false color here so we can see it properly. So when we open this results overview, we can see that um, the calculation surface says that we have 390 lux on the surface or on the table. And you can see another report here says this is a candela per square meter or meaning luminance. Okay. So this is, a, this is the values for the illuminance, which is the lux, 390 lux. And this is the value for luminance, which is the candela per square meter. So those are the units of these two. So illuminance is lux and then luminance is candela per square meter. And we got 92.4 candela per square meter. So that is the luminance that we receive uh, by perception in this room. Okay, just remember 390 lux and then 92 lux, uh, 92 candela for the luminance. Okay, so this is, let's screenshot this one. Okay, so print screen. Uh, before that, let's go and control R. Now you can see those uh, downlights is really pointing to the, towards the calculation surface. Okay, and then let's print screen it. I will show you something. Okay, let's remove this one now. I'm going to explain to you the luminance and illuminance. Okay, so this is the downlight on the table. So the luminance, sorry, the illuminance is the one that is light emitting towards the surface. That is the uh, illuminance. Okay, while the luminance, on the other hand, let's use another thing here. Okay while the luminance is something that is bouncing on the wall and then goes back to the calculation surface. So that is something like that and then bounce back. And then again, another, all the areas, actually all the areas and then bounce back. So that is the luminance. That's why we perceive the room as bright. If the room is a uh, light colored wall or white colored wall because there are so many lights bouncing on the surface. That's why we perceive it's bright room. Now, this is the idea. 
What if we change one wall into a dark, or one or two walls into a dark color? And uh, I'm sure the, the luminous value or the perceived value of light becomes lesser. Okay, so let's go and do it. So I'm going to change now the color of this one into something like maybe, uh, um, let's go for blue, something like that. Okay, so I'm just dragging it there, yes. Okay, and then I will apply it here and also in this side. Okay, so before we have 390 lux and 92 candela per square meter. So let's go and calculate it again. Yes, now we have 379 and the candela becomes lesser. It becomes 89. Okay, so it becomes lesser. Why is that? From 92, it becomes 89. It's because the bouncing light is not bouncing anymore. The light is now absorbed by the blue color. So there are less bouncing light. So that's why we perceive it now a little bit dark area but it's the same luminaire it's the same wattage same lumen output but we perceive it a little darker now because of the color of the wall because there are no bouncing lights anymore going towards the calculation surface okay so that is the luminance is the light emitting from the luminaire while luminance is the one that is bouncing all over the place and perceived by our eyes. Okay, so that's luminance. And this is illuminance. Okay, so I hope you learned something today. And if you want to learn more, I created a new course in Udemy and that is all about uh, the basics of lighting design. So go and check that one later on. I hope Udemy will approve it soon. So if you want to learn more about this basic information about lighting design, like what is luminance, illuminance, wattage, efficacy, efficiency, and all, all other stuff, CRI, CCT, go and check that one. That another course from Udemy, the, the lighting design basics. Okay, so see you again on the next video. And of course, don't forget to subscribe.